What's up everybody, it's 10 from 12 volt mods again. Uh, I'm just working on my uh, Tamiya semi-trailer here. I've uh, just been working on the lights, as you can see. Just doing a little walk around here, showing you what I did. It's not done yet. So far, as you can see, it's just the uh, side lights and the uh, brake lights. Now, the brake lights actually are functional. So right now, as you can see, they're just uh, regular running lights and then brake lights. Now, I made these a little different. As you can see with my controller here, if I go forward and let it go, it stays like that. But if I go back and let it go, the brake lights stay on as it's still in stop mode. So I don't have to hold it. But if I go forward and then brake and then forward again, it just doesn't do anything. Until I hit forward, that's when the brake lights actually go off. Side lights actually stay on like normal. There's five on each side. I will have a license plate light, uh, two turn signal lights here and here. Like I said, the license plate light, and then this bottom bar right here, I'm actually going to fill it just like these brake lights as my reverse light. So they're going to be, it's going to be a super bright reverse light. And then I'm going to build a piece inside here and everything, like an actual chrome piece that actually goes in between the tail lights, and that's for the license plate and that, and then the little LED that's going to sit here to shine on the license plate. These stickers are actually going to come off and everything, I'm going to change them. Um, as you can see, the top. Uh, a good friend of mine actually uh, made the top for me. There's actually a little stainless steel little uh, nail heads, so they look like actually studs all throughout the whole thing. And then it's been stained and uh, uh, burnt and everything else, so it looks like it's used, as you can see. And it comes off because of all the wiring. <laughs> the wiring's not even done yet. Uh, this controller here is a custom controller that I made. Um, this works my turn signals and uh, my other um, add-ons that I can actually plug onto the top. When I put the like the rack on and everything on the top of the trailer, I can actually uh, hook at uh, plug in other lights that actually this control bar will actually work and everything. Um, this is just a splitter um, that actually runs all these lights, the side lights. And this is the actual uh, brake controller here. Um, everything is off of receiver power. So it just plugs into a receiver. I will have a plug in the front here that plugs directly in. But right now I just put uh, several plugs and it's just plugged into my receiver for now. Just so I can test it. But uh, yeah, it will have full functional turn signals and everything. Um, the landing gear is electric. But uh, instead of having a switch and everything, it's actually going to be controlled off my controller, off a channel. So um, there will be another control module just for the landing gear by itself. So when the trailer's plugged into the truck and everything else, I can actually control the landing gear by the truck. So which works a lot better. So then there's no power source or anything on the trailer. So the only the way the trailer will power up is when it's hooked up to the truck. But uh, yeah, uh, it's going to have some under lighting and everything else. So it's going to be like some show stuff and everything. It's going to have under lights, a color change in that, just for show. Um, so some other custom details and everything. Um, but this is what happens when you get sick and have a nasty cold for almost a month. And you're cooped up in your house and you can't really go anywhere. You start working on stuff that's boring uh, when you get bored out of your mind. And this is a project that I've been wanting to do. But uh, I keep putting it off because I have other stuff I should be doing. But I'm so sick that I can't really do too, too much. So I just sit here in front of the TV, as you can see, watching TV in my living room. And I just sit here and slowly put away. Hope you guys like what you see. Uh, there's still a lot more to do to this trailer. And I'll have another finished product video when it's done. Thanks for watching.